Built to stay tough. Super highways, back roads, no roads at all. The four-wheel drive Blazer has earned a solid reputation for strength in some of the rugged country America has to offer. On-road, off-road, Blazer is the way to go. Available full-time four-wheel drive. Back in 1979, this was a standard custom deluxe interior, or you had the optional Cheyenne interior. Also in 1979, they offered the available rally wheels on the left or the styled wheels on the right. Added a touch of class to your blazer. There was also the Comfort Tilt Steering Wheel, which adjusted to six different positions for driver comfort and the special blazer hood striping as part of the available exterior decor package. And in 1979, two dealer installed options were the exterior spare tire mount and you could have your four-wheel drive blazer prepared for snow by installing a snow plow. Hey, welcome back to the channel, and yes, that's it. That is the TRX4 K5 uh, blazer. We did get this last week in our store. Uh, as you can see up on the top there, it's part of the first delivery program. Uh, this sitting on display in the store. I didn't want to do an unboxing. There were so many of those, but I did want to uh, look at this truck real close and highlight some of the features that Traxxas has gone above and beyond to make this as scale and as real as possible. All right, so here we are, uh, top off the truck. As far as I know, all the first delivery stores received uh, the red in color blazer. And you can look at the chassis, not much of a difference than a regular TRX4 except for the chrome bumpers, front and rear. And the wheels. Now I do know Traxxas uh, took a lot of time in developing of the wheels to make them look like the center steel wheels, just like the original Blazer had. And of course the little four x four decal there. One of the features I wanted to highlight with these wheels is the center cap is removable, kind of covers the wheel nut. And something else that was always very popular on this model um, was that USA One license plate. I don't know if Chevy gave those away or if that just happened to be a popular uh, aftermarket purchase that owners of these Blazers had. Traxxas did include that on the front and rear of these trucks. On the grill assembly for the Chevy Blazer, uh, this uh, is not a sticker. Same way with the marker lights on the side. The windshield wipers, the mirror, and the door handle, those are all three-dimensional. Now the K5 and the Cheyenne on the back are stickers. And one other thing I thought was kind of neat is the way that the body is molded. It fits right in behind and kind of hooks in. So it's got a little bit of protection behind that rock slider. Kind of tucks in behind there. The detail that has gone into this truck. Um, hands down to Traxxas, they did an awesome job truck. Again the tail lights, those are uh, plastic buckets that are, are put into the body uh, so you know there's going to be a light kit coming and zoom way in, I don't know if my camera's even going to pick it up, but just the detail on uh, the window mechanism, you know if you look at it real real close, which my camera's not going to pick it up, but you can even see where back in the day the key would have went in there to lower that rear window. Let's look inside the body. This would be to the front grill area. So those little four gray pieces are holding the grill in and you got your headlight buckets and you even got that little side marker light. Looks like this truck's almost already prepared uh, for a light kit. We scroll back the body, it looks like the mirrors can come on and off. It looks like they just have body clips in there holding them on. And then you got the 
rear tail light buckets and that's the mechanism that's holding on the window gate and with this model you got the inner fenders already mounted inside there place to put your rock lights your optional battery I hope you enjoyed this overview of some of the detailed features of the K5 Blazer offered by Traxxas. If you did, please give this video a thumbs up. Also click the subscribe button, turn that little bell on to get notified for any future videos. Now thanks for watching, and remember use the hashtag RCAdventures when posting on social media so we can check out your ride.